Hello, in these uh, next few moments, what I'd like to share with you is some information that I found really exciting and certainly uh, going to change the dynamics of your health. And please forgive me if I uh, refer to these sheets here because I don't want to uh, misinform you. I want to make sure that I've gotten all of the information here clear to you. But uh, according to um, a published journal called the Molecular and Cellular Oncology, there was research that was done from Rutgers University and Hunter College that showed that there's a major antioxidant found in olive oil that's capable of killing cancer cells in less than one hour without, uh, uh, without harming the healthy cells at the same time. Now, uh, understand that one of the major components is found in the Mediterranean diet. And if you're not familiar with this, you can Google it certainly, but understand that there is no really true Mediterranean diet, but it's just a, a compilation of many contributions of foods from the various countries surrounding the Mediterranean. But in this, there are the, uh, in the Mediterranean diet, you'll find that olive oil is one of the mainstays in it. And according to uh, the researcher Paul Breslin, he stated that um, the study points directly to an olive oil phenolic, which is called oleocanthal. Oleocanthal is very important in um, in in what is the the um, agent that is destroying these cancer cells. As a matter of fact, the studies show that the cancer cells exposed to the oleocanthal died within 30 to 60 minutes of, of, of the exposure. And what was significant was that the oleocanthal did not harm nearby healthy cells. Instead, it put them into a, a state of stasis or hibernation for about a 24-hour period, after which they became engaged once again without any adverse or, uh, or apparent lasting effects. This is really, really exciting, folks. The olive oil also has been shown, or its components, has a, a wide a variety of benefits to the body, including strengthening your immune system, preventing osteoporosis, uh, protecting the body from the adverse effects of air pollution. It also is very beneficial um, as far as boosting the brain health and may even help in pr improving your memory and reducing um, the, the possibility of, develop of developing dementia. Now, also, there was a study done in 20. Uh, 10. This was conducted by the research at the Universitat uh, Autonoma de, de Barcelona, a university in Barcelona, Spain, and they also suggested, according to this research, that the olive oil may help to prevent uh, cancer. The researchers found that the olive oil led to changes in signaling pathways of breast cancer cells, uh, that led to apoptosis, which means that the that the cancer cells that were manifesting in the breast were actually exploding or dying prematurely. It was causing them to rupture and die. And again, please remember that this is only the cancer cells, but leaving the healthy cells um, untouched and uh, continuing in the, in their healthy function. So. The point of all of this is to remind you that, again, your health is not dependent upon drugs or surgery or chemicals that are added to your body, but rather it's uh, based upon decisions that you make on a daily basis. And remember, as the adage says, you are what you eat. Well, if we take that a little further, if you make quality choices regarding the foods that you eat, if you eat well, you can end up being well. And this goes a long way in ensuring that you have the best performance of your life. Again, I hope that this information has been helpful and beneficial. And as always, until the next time, God bless.